Hey Filmmaker Shundi here. In this video we're going to show you how to do a double or multiple stroke effect on your text. And this is a way to make your design more stylized to fit more with the design of your company or like your channel. So let's start. So first press T on your keyboard or press this icon for the type tool. Then click anywhere on your preview screen to make a text box. And now type in something that you want to write. I type in double strokes and I'm going to move this into the middle. And here we have the stroke effect or stroke appearance. So when we select that, and right now it's quite on a fixed stroke, can add a stroke to it. Let's change this color to something else maybe to black and we can see this thick black stroke coming up however it looks okay but maybe you want to have like a extra color there is no extra option here to like copy and add another stroke there is no yeah extra button here so what we're going to do is we're going to copy this text and select here inside of your effects control and press command C and then command V. So we copied it. So we have here two of them, two text here. So what we need to know about how the effects control works, what's on the bottom is actually on top. So if we go to go here on the top one and we change this color of this stroke to like red, we see now a slight red hint coming out, but uh, normally you wouldn't see that. But now if we drag this, we can see this third stroke appearing. So this is quite interesting. Let's make it maybe a slightly darker shade of red. And actually it was pretty okay with that one. So can make it a thicker stroke so we have now a double stroke and literally you can go beyond and even add like a third color if you wanted to so that was today's quick tutorial how to add double or multiple strokes to your text to stylize them and make it more interesting hope you guys like this video and please give me a thumbs up if you are new to this channel please hit that subscribe button here below and i'll see you guys the next time bye bye